We all know that technology is changing the world that we live in. Computers are everywhere, and no matter what career you choose, computers are going to be changing the way that you work. As a computer scientist, you can be part of this revolution, whether that be developing AI, driverless cars, well-being robots that can support the elderly or the vulnerable, helping to take man deeper into space, or creating devices that are going to help people to live their lives more safely or in a more fun way. With computer science, anything is possible. And A-level computer science brings a wonderful mix of being able to learn about the hardware of any computer system, the way in which computers communicate, how they store and manipulate data, the moral and ethical implications of using computer systems, but at the same time learning to be a programmer, developing your programming skills, helping you to further or develop your ability to create as well as to consume content. Computer science A-level is both highly creative as well as being theoretical. And computer science as a subject goes really well with lots of others. You may be thinking about taking it alongside sciences like physics and chemistry, alongside maths, but equally it goes very well with humanities subjects and languages. And over the years we've had pupils that have done combinations of all of these. Computer science at A-level is tough. You've got to enjoy problem solving, which after all is a great skill for life. You've got to enjoy programming, and you need to be a confident mathematician. So maths is really important and you need to be looking to get a good grade at GCSE level maths. If you haven't studied GCSE computer science, I'd also be hoping that you would be a confident programmer and you would have real experience in scripting in a language like Python or C Sharp or C++. Now there are a variety of pathways that you could be looking to follow with computer science. Maybe a traditional science subjects, maybe engineering, but there are so many opportunities where computer science is at the center of what you might be doing. That could be games design, artificial intelligence, cyber security. There are so many different areas of computer science which are exciting and things that you may want to get involved in. Now, maths is really important uh, in terms of computer science. So if you're thinking about doing a computer science degree, you really do need to make sure that you're taking A-level maths too. And it may also be worth checking at universities that you're already thinking of what their entry requirements are. Now, we follow the OCR computer science course uh, at Bab Lake, and that course is 80% theory and 20% practical. So we spend a lot of time developing theoretical knowledge and building your understanding of the theory around computer systems. But as I said earlier, that programming and practical element of the course is really important. And one of the things I think is really exciting about A-level computer science is that in the second year of your studies, you're going to be able to undertake a significant project and in that project, you're going to be able to follow a problem through from inception all the way to the delivery to your stakeholders of a solution. And that's going to be a project that's going to interest you. It could be creating a game. It could be creating a solution to a problem that perhaps your parents have identified in, in their line of work or something else that you're interested in, maybe something your friends have suggested. And you're going to have the opportunity to work with these stakeholders in order to direct the project all the way through from your design through creation and testing and evaluation. And I think that's a really exciting element of our computer science course. Lots of people have studied computer science at Bablake and gone on to do computer science degrees at a variety of different universities. But equally, we've had pupils who've gone on to study all sorts of different things. And, and that's where that flexibility and that creativity means that computer science goes very nicely with so many different subjects. So you might not even be thinking about computer science as a career or a degree, but it'd still be a great course for you to consider doing so that you can be one of those involved in the technical revolution in the future. So I did computer science because I think it would be a good idea for doing it for engineering. Uh, the best thing I like about computer science is mainly the coding aspect and the use of binary because I'm, I'm a mathematician myself so I like dealing with numbers. And uh, I came from a different school so I have like other like knowledge that I can bring into the table for Bab Lake and I'm enjoying Bab Lake 6 form very, very well. For my programming project I'm making a projectile motion simulator which has helped extend my physics knowledge. And it also ties into engineering, which I hope to pursue a career in. Learning about systems design is also important in computer science and engineering, and has given me a better insight into what engineering might be like in the future. I think it's a real shame that more girls don't do computer science, because I think it's a really good subject. It's really interesting. It helps develop your problem-solving skills, and it goes really well with maths, which I'm really interested in. I didn't really know what career I wanted to do, so I just wanted to do subjects I enjoyed and that I was good at, 
And ever since starting computer science A-level, I've discovered that I really like it and I'm interested in it because it goes into a lot more depth and I want to take that up in the future. So if you're a girl and you don't know what it's like, just give it a try and you never know, you might end up studying computer science A-level.